Trevor Noah helped by Chris Christie through first Daily Show political interview. A lot of people don't know you were one of the first people to wish me good luck for the job, Trevor Noah said, welcoming his first ever political guest, New Jersey Governor Chris Christie to the Daily Show. That happened on Long Island, over the summer. You were wearing shorts. I will never remember that, Noah said, correcting to forget that. Christie joked at us better he forget. You look good in shorts, Noah insisted, revealing more nerves, and maybe a slightly disturbing obsequiousness in interviews. Oh, stop now. Listen, there is no requirement to lie on your first week on this job, the veteran campaigner responded, charming Noah, and the studio audience. I guess that is different from your job, Noah shot back, getting his footing. Chris T.S. remarks about how he'd make sure non-residents of this country did not overstay their visas made the South African comedian feel like you were talking to me personally. But what I didn't get was the biometrics, he said. Do you want people to get FedEx stamps? No, 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 Chris T. said, seeming to try to mimic Noah's South African accent, badly. He explains his plan to track tourists and students using their thumbprints. If the database says you've overstayed, we tap you on the shoulder and say, thanks for coming. You should go home, Christie said. When Noah mentioned the price it had, Christie shot back that it is a lot cheaper than building Donald Trump a swall across our country's southern border, adding, how about that? 